Okay, we're going to try two things. One is the palm lifting or the palm takeoff of the DJI Spark, which can be done without your mobile phone or without an RC control. In other words, you can control it purely with gestures and it, uh, it uses facial recognition. It knows who you are. So uh, I'm inside in the evening, so that's another test. We're going to fly inside my house and it's a good thing that wifey isn't home so uh, we'll be able to test this out and hopefully we won't hit anything so it's good to start with a full battery when you're working with any of these tests and the first thing I'm going to do is just turn the spark on in the typical way now once it's on I'm going to hold it in my hand with the camera facing my face the idea is it's going to recognize me, but only after I press that rear button twice. So I go, doop, doop, press it twice. Now, if it likes me, it should recognize my face, and it should fire up. Now that's pretty steady for an interior drone, small room, lots of lights, lots of chandeliers, other things. So that's gesture mode. Um, it should follow my hand signal to some degree. We can do much more of that outside tomorrow. I use my flat palm. See if I can move it. And sure enough, it likes that distance right there. We'll see if that works. Now, in terms of landing, you can either put your palm under it, of course. You always have to make sure that you're facing the camera, as you're facing the front of the spark, because that's what's recognizing you and allowing you this gesture control. Again, when it's running, you can land it in your palm by putting your palm under it. But I also noticed if you point up to the bottom cameras, it will land itself on the ground. So let's just try that again to make sure that works. I'm going to hold this with the camera facing me again and give it two quick little uh, likes me. Now that's cool. Now these are pre-release models, so there's a number of other gesture functions, some of them which will work outside, like I don't want to get this thing too far away from me here. It has follow me, and it'll do selfies and things like that. Uh, we'll fiddle around with those tomorrow, and I'm sure when the production versions come and they upgrade the firmware, there's going to be a lot more fun in this gesture mode. Thanks for watching.